So, I will move into a bit more specific about the product itself now, um, what it does and the benefits that it's going to give you. Um, the way we see the product now, um, it's not just a networking product. Um, it, we have impacts on every area of your network and we're seeing those areas becoming more and more converged and, and sitting together. So problems you may have with your network, obviously net, um, bandwidth, you never have as much bandwidth on the WAN as you do on the LAN. Latency, very, um, very um, sort of important problem but often overlooked. Um, storage problems, perhaps you have data stored all across your estate, islands of storage, problems with backing up and replicating across WAN links, uh, and problems with the applications themselves becoming very slow, um, etc. So we have a solution that's going to benefit all three areas, solve all three problems, and we look at it as one single solution. So the areas that our product will actually benefit you, um, first of all, application acceleration across the wide area network. So if you are using any sort of you know, basic uh, sort of file sharing technologies, perhaps Microsoft SharePoint, um, email, whether that be Microsoft Exchange or Lotus Notes, anything web-based like intranets, um, company intranets for example, um, if you're using SSL encryption across the WAN, ERP and CRM type applications, databases, Canon BIM um, applications, all of those types of applications we have specific inbuilt optimizations to improve their performance across the wide area network and accelerate them by uh, many orders of magnitude. You'll also see custom applications listed there separately. Uh, reason being that we will benefit anything that uses TCP uh, as the transport protocol. So even if that's an in-house bespoke application, if it's using TCP, you're going to see a benefit to that by, by using Riverbed. So obviously, all of that acceleration um, aids the productivity of your workers and also enables us to move into the next uh, part of the story, the consolidation and virtualization story. So the idea is that because we are able to accelerate all these applications over the wide area network, we make consolidation possible. So you can remove all the file, email servers from the edge of your network, um, associated local um, backup and backup to tape, bring everything back to the data center, and with our acceleration, your workers in branch offices won't notice that those local services have gone. They'll still be experiencing a LAN-like perform, uh, performance. Also, if you are um, looking at, at virtualizing uh, servers for, for further consolidation, um, no issue with us uh, being interoperable with it. And we also have ways of helping you consolidate further at the branch level, and I'll show you more of that as we go along. Um, we really are looking to offer you a branch office in a box concept and, and make the serverless branch a, a reality. Bandwidth optimization, again I'm going to show you what we do around this. Um, and we will reduce the amount of traffic that you actually send across the wide area network. So perhaps upgrades you may be considering to your, uh, to your WAN um, are, not, are no longer necessary. And in fact, deploying Riverbed is a much more intelligent and uh, solution that will give you better performance and I will elaborate on that further. Um, locations with very low bandwidth where you're struggling on, with congestion, again we will reduce the amount of traffic that's actually uh, crossing that link, reduce the congestion problem and at the same time give you a virtual capacity increase. So low bandwidth locations all of a sudden perform much much better. Um, satellite communications, very high latency, low bandwidth links, we're very very good at accelerating. Um, and quality of service there, we have the ability to, to apply quality of service type rules across your network. Um, perhaps you have voice over IP or video conferencing traffic on your network that you would like to protect and ensure the delivery of. So we can actually do that, we'll, we'll benefit the traffic by first of all um, freeing up more bandwidth for it in the first place, you can then apply some quality of service rules to it um, and your data traffic still running in the background at land-like speeds at the same time. The last area we'll look to help you in is disaster recovery. Um, if you have a disaster recovery set up, uh, then using Riverbed is, uh, is almost a no-brainer. 
we'll, uh, we'll reduce the amount of time it takes you to, to replicate your traffic to your DR location. We will no, won't need as much bandwidth to do that. And then if you actually need to reboot your systems from your DR center, um, that reboot time is drastically uh, improved too. So your recovery time obje objective is, is shortened, your recovery point objective is, is better, your, your data can be much fresher, much more up to date because you can replicate your traffic more often. Um, we can also benefit any sorts of uh, WAN backups that you may have previously thought impossible, we will make it very possible for you. So the product uh, itself, um, it's all a, a single platform approach. It's delivered by the form of, of appliances for office to office acceleration, uh, point to point, so you require an appliance uh, in, in each location. But we also extend the technology to a, a soft client version uh, designed for, for laptop users or home workers. So if you're connecting in over to the network over a, a VPN client, whether you're from home over ADSL, whether you're out in the middle of nowhere using a, a 3G card or perhaps sat in a, in a hotel connecting over, over Wi-Fi, we extend exactly the same technology and benefits to those mobile workers as we do to, to workers in branch offices. So the actual technology that we run, um, although we are supplying hardware in many cases, it's, it's the software that runs on that hardware that's uh, providing the functionality. And we have a four-pronged approach to what we're doing, um, designed to tackle different issues. So the first bit I will show you shortly is how we solve problems with, uh, with the bandwidth limitations you have over the wide area network, uh, the way we'll optimize that bandwidth and uh, ensure that congestion is not an issue. The second area we're going to look at is, is TCP itself and the chattiness of TCP. Um, this is something that becomes an issue over the wide area network because the issue of latency is, is introduced, something we don't struggle with uh, on the wide area network. Uh, and that's impacted both by the chattiness of TCP and then also by the chattiness of the applications themselves and their individual protocols. And it's these areas that really cause us pain and really cause uh, applications to, to run slowly over the wide area network. And this is the reason why adding bandwidth alone is never going to give you the, the uh, the improvements you're looking for if you're trying to accelerate the, uh, the performance of applications. The fourth area we do look at is something we call management streamlining and it's just a, a variety of features designed to make the product extremely easy to deploy, extremely easy to, uh, to manage moving forward also. Uh, 